Today's Bible study is titled, What Will You Do With the Truth? The scripture or Bible stands alone and unique among books to which people have access today. It is the only book that claims to be authored by God, not just once but a number of times. Let's look at a few verses in the Apostle Peter, writing regarding the prophetic scriptures, states in 1 Peter 1 21, For the prophecy came not in old time by the will of man, but holy men of God spake as they were moved by the Holy Ghost, and God's method of developing written communication to mankind. Example, men of God moved by the Holy Spirit to write God's word, is how all of the scripture came to be and all scripture is truth. In Genesis 1, God's word begins with, In the beginning God created the heaven and the earth, and it ends with, He which testifies these things says, Surely, I come quickly. Amen. Even so, come, Lord Jesus. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all. Amen. Revelation 22, 2021. And from cover to cover it is truth. Numerous times in what is the Old Testament, the scripture states, Thus says the Lord. And every time this was a word of prophecy, at the time they were to be fulfilled, these came true. In fact, as a word in our study of the word of truth, Together we have found that all scripture is given by inspiration of God and is profitable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness, that the man of God may be perfect, thoroughly furnished unto all good works. And further, we came to know that the key to understanding the content or intent of all scripture was to study to shew thyself approved unto God, a workman that needest not to be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of truth, to dependent on the willingness of man to receive the truth of the Bible, the word of God, the reception may include one who comes to the knowledge of the truth, 2 Timothy 3, 7, one who has erred concerning the truth, 2 Timothy 2, 18, one who will acknowledge the truth, Titus 1, 1, one who will resist the truth, 2 Timothy 3, 8, or one who will turn away their ears from the truth, 2 Timothy 4, 2, 4. Regardless of the action of the hearer and reader, the truth of the Bible stands. Believer, what will you do with the truth? Thank you for listening to this Bible study today.